This is a construction update for the week of November 11th, prepared by the City of Somerville and read by Somerville Media Center. Improvement Projects Mass DOT contractors plan to continue addressing final punch list cleanup items. They'll apply the remaining green surface treatment when weather permits between Ivalu Street and Oxford Street. Mass DOT estimates two to three mobilizations are needed to finish the application. Please expect variable parking restrictions and bike lane closures. Beacon Street remains an active construction site, and cyclists are advised to continue using the bike detour until the project is complete. Green Line Extension. The GLX team will host their next public meeting Tuesday, November 19th at the East Somerville Community School at 6.30 p.m. The meeting will preview the next year of construction activity, and project staff will share updated information on station designs and construction progress. Among recent construction updates, steel work is now complete on the new half of the Washington Street Rail overpass. Concrete no noise walls that serve as retaining walls have been set between McGrath Highway and Walnut Street. Steel noise wall panels are expected to be placed above the retaining wall sections later this year or in early 2020. Between School Street and Sycamore Street, crews continue to place a 16-inch stormwater lane, which will run along mostly alignment. This section of the work is reported to be about 75% complete. Frequent overnight and weekend work is expected to continue through the end of the year. If you need assistance for a GLX construction-related matter, please call the 24-7 GLX hotline at 1-855-GLX-INFO. That's 1-855-459-4636 or email info at glxinfo.com. Sacramento Street Underpass Rehabilitation. The remaining railings have been fabricated and sent to be hot dipped galvanized, which is expected to take 10 to 12 days to complete. After those have been installed, the underpass will reopen projected by the end of November. Summer will have utility and streetscape improvements. Starting as early as Tuesday, November 12th, the Merriam Street and Somerville Ave intersection on the north side, next to the Public Safety Building, is expected to close during work hours, approximately 6.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. for approximately one week. Abutters can enter and exit the northern section of Merriam Street via Washington Street. Crews will drive large steel micropiles into the ground in advance of future work at this location. Starting on or around Wednesday, November 13th, for an estimated three days, Somerville Ave between Webster Ave and Prospect Street is expected to close in both directions during work hours, approximately 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. Both Barletta and Eversource Gas will be working in the area. City contractors plan to begin installing another section of the 800,000 gallon box culvert drainage system in front of Stone Ave. For the next month or so, Stone Ave and Stone Place can be accessed via Columbus Ave. On Somerville Ave, between Prospect Street and Miriam Street, contractors plan to continue restoring curbing and sidewalks installing drainage. Somerville High School Building Project At the Western Wing, crews continue to install overhead ducts and sprinklers and plumbing and to advance work on the, on the facade and roof. Windows for the first two levels are expected to be installed within the next several weeks. At the new theater, roof steel installation continues and crews are ex excavating an elevator pit. Electrical work is ongoing at the gym. At the eastern wing, foundations and steel installation continue. Washington Street water main upgrades. City contractors plan to begin transferring individual water services that, a that are connected to the temporary service over to the next new water main. Citywide manhole rehabilitation. National Water Main, the city's contractor, is rehabilitating manholes throughout Somerville through the spring of 2020. Lane closures, lane shifts, and parking restrictions may be implemented as needed. During the week of November 11th, crews plan to be on the following streets. Aberdeen Road, Ashland Street, Bank Street, Broadway, Rogers Ave to Willow Ave, Burnside Ave, Cherry Street, Elm Street to Summer Street, Hawthorne Street, Ivalu Street, Kent Street, Morrison Ave, Cedar Street to Pritchard Ave, Sartwell Ave, Stanford Terrace, Willow Ave, Elm Street to Summer Street, and Windsor Road. Additional utility work. 
Utility companies are responsible for notifying residents prior to conducting any work, but we expect parking restrictions and lane shifts due to the following utility work. Detail officers may close a road if deemed necessary for safety. Eversource Gas will be having construction on the following streets. Berkeley Street, Dearborn Road, Highland Road, Pearson Road, Seven Pine Ave, and Winter Street. And National Grid will also be in construction on Middlesex Ave. For any additional resources, please visit the City of Somerville Construction website. This has been your construction update for the week of November 11th, prepared by the City of Somerville and read by Somerville Media Center. Thank <laughs> you.